Yeah. Oh god. Oh my god. Let's, Let's just go. run away. Yeah, that happens here. <laughs> oh, I've been T bone. <laughs> Pretty much get tased again. What do you mean again? You didn't hit me the first two times. <laughs> I can come pick you up there. Oh, there's the garage here. I, I think it's like a okay. Do you want to meet me at the ammunition in the city then? Yeah. Like the main one. My vehicle stands out from space, so you'll know which one's me. Okay, one of my characters has a charge for murder, so I guess that counts for felony. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely. I know Richard Bastard has a felony, who I'm... No, am I playing as Richard? I should be. Yeah. So that's all we're... That's literally all we're gonna do. I'm thinking the quarry, the stone quarry, go and have a few shots up there. And, um... When the police turn up, be like, nah, we're, um... We don't need a license for these, they're antiques. Because I was distinctly told by 520 yesterday that you don't need a license and you can own one of these if you have a felony. So that's what we're testing the cops for, I guess. The one thing I'm thinking of is if we did do this in the stone quarry, then they could get us on a trespassing charge. Yeah, I say we just do it um, like in the national park or something. Or is that illegal? That's illegal. Um, okay. The one side of Grand Sonoran that is a national park, the other side is an airfield. Like, assume Panorama's the split. Yeah. And then around the airfield, as long as you don't shoot into the sky, I see. I don't see why you can't do it there. Because the only national parks I know of is Grand Sonora and Raton Canyon. Yeah, we could just do it around the airfield. Maybe um, by the top. Not the Tate. Yeah, I think it is the Tatavian Mountains. I mean, we'd be doing them a favour if we start shooting some birds. Yeah, exactly. I actually got charged with 46 counts of shooting birds before. And um, it's 10 grand per bird. <laughs> I was like, yeah. 46 counts? Yeah. How, how did you manage 46? I was shooting birds. It was like, I was just shooting birds. And I saw Cassie and went, oh yeah, I just killed th uh, 46 of the bastards. And they charged me with it. <laughs> Even though I then told them that I was joking. Mm -hmm. So I took, I had like 10 years straight in jail for that, for shooting fucking pigeons. <laughs> it is a bit ridiculous. Oh, there it is. I, I thought that was you, that truck was going a little bit quick. Hey, I was only doing what, 10 over? <laughs> only. I was only doing 150 of them. Of course, now they've introduced that... Oh yeah, that's actually pretty cool. They've introduced that point system on your license now, haven't they? Yep. So now you get reapply for license if it gets revoked. And you get, I believe it's 12 points and you get suspended. And they can issue them, usually in multiples of three, but if it's serious they'll do like 6 or 12 points. Right, Grand Sonoran Desert, I guess. I guess I'll follow you. <laughs> well, yeah, if you manage to lose me, then you're fired. You're just fired from life oh, in general. Cool. Thanks. Well, I didn't hit <clears throat> you on my screen. <laughs> That's got to be a Civ car. Come on. There's no way that's an, a that's an AI car. Seriously? It's casually Is it locked? I don't know. Do you want it? It looks pretty good. Uh, I, don't fancy, uh, I don't fancy driving around a stolen vehicle, though, to be honest. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh my God. Let's, Let's just go. run away. Yeah, that happens here. <laughs> oh, I've been T boned. <laughs> yeah, traffic's just fucking spawning. Let's go. If we get pulled over, a truck was falling from the sky. 
Right, we should be safe now. <laughs> also, it says the one that was moaning about me doing 10 over as he stonks off into the distance. Ah, oh, I'm fucking joking about that. I speed all the time. I've had a ticket for 158 before. Uh, yeah, I've gone above 120 once. There's a car. They fixed it now, but when the car's the Jester, if you modified it right, it would go 210 miles per hour. And I got a ticket for, I think it was 178. Well, I say ticket, I got arrested for 178. I, uh, I, I bought my carbonates there and tested it out on the... Uh, on Route 15, because like you hardly ever get any cops on there, so yeah. And then I slowed down just at the 15:13 uh, merge thing, but uh, I guess I did it too late, and the cops saw me. <laughs> I think he clocked me at 1:41. Oof. I don't know. <clears throat> I didn't even see him though. Because I, I automatically slowed down to like 75 and just cruised on the flu. The amount of times that's he... happened where I've been flying down a road, which I know, checking all the classic hiding spots for cops, there's none there. I look behind me, there's a cop behind me, and you're like, where the f where were you? <laughs> oh, this guy was proper bush hiding. Yeah, full on bushwhacking it. But, uh... Yeah, so I slowed down to 75 and then like 30 seconds later he comes cruising up behind me. <laughs> I was like, oh shit. Yep, that happens. Another times I've been, another way I've been caught out a few times is flying up here and there'll be a car in the bushes on the left by there. I've been caught. Oh, I was going about 90 along here and the cop caught me but he didn't clock me. So he just had some like really stern words. <laughs> <laughs> I was flying down here before and an AI cut across by here and I swerved to avoid it, spun out and I missed the cop car by about three inches. I just slid right past him sideways. Yeah, I think down this dirt road, shooting off the tower maybe. Well, uh, well I brought the right vehicle. I didn't. <laughs> no, I, didn't they? I think do a few shots to see if the police hear them and manage to pinpoint them. I might just them. do it from the back of my truck. Yeah, fair enough. Right, birds, 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 where are you? Oh, there's well, a sheriff one. over there. <laughs> oh, where? <laughs> let me aim at him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's, let's not do that. I'm so terrible at aiming with this thing. I might go first person, actually. Yeah, that cop's interested. He's on the dirt road. That was quick. <laughs> if he asked, we were just shooting at this main of dirt here. Hey, how's it going, Dave? Hey, Dave. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, yeah. yeah. I'm on my mobile. <clears throat> Don't know about you, I'm just doing target practice with some cacti. Yeah. I'm on, I must have been server. Hey, what? I must have been the server. Uh, yeah. Good. Not actually, I'm on computer, I'm just making a two. Fair enough. Yeah, me and Josh are doing some target practice in the desert with muskets. Oh. oh. I'll be back. I've been. Oh, we got a cop pointing a gun at us. Oh. Right, I'm getting low on ammo. Do you want to go to the uh, ammunition? I've got, uh, I've got quite a lot. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm going to skedaddle to the ammunition then. There goes the siren, right? <laughs> mm -hmm. Dave, stop slurping. <laughs> God damn it, dude. 
Are they actually going to priority stop us? They better fucking not. I don't know, but I've not heard anything. We need you to set up the vehicle here, sir. Is there any particular reason why you're pulled out in front of me like that? Yes, sir. We were approaching you back there at the uh, water tower when you guys were shooting out of your trucks. And uh, when you guys finally saw us, you decided to take off. I didn't see you. I was just going to get some more ammo. So that's why you uh, were uh, hitting the gas to get out of here? I didn't hit the gas. I was just driving down a dirt road. Okay, you have your license insurance on you, sir? Uh, yeah, one sec. Put my windows down. Nope, not flip vehicle. Here you go, my name's Richard Bastard. Alright, Mr. Bastard, sit tight. Appreciate if you keep those weapons locked up, thank you. Okay. Just so you know, I am going to run if he tries to, to arrest me. I'm going to declare that now. Can't arrest you if you're hunting. No, I've got a felony, but I was distinctly told by 520 that a musket um, you can have if you have felony because it's classed as an antique. So, if he tries to get me on that, I'm going to fucking run. Reference... No, don't run reference 520, it's how you saw legal advice Yeah. a law enforcement officer. Yeah, and if that don't work, then I'll run. <laughs> yeah. All last fire yeah, just run. Like, I'm coming on in a minute. Okay. If I'm on in time, I'll be your lawyer. <laughs> yeah. I'll bring out Crystal Smith. I, f I thought you said Crystal Meth, then I was going to smack you. That's the point of her name. Yeah, it's so Crystal Smith. But, yeah. Well, no, Crystal Smith is her actual name. I don't like the way he was stood behind his vehicle like that. Okay, I'm concerned now. I'm gonna get out of my my van and just quickly put my musket in the back. Deposit, musket, 25. Can that dude please stop pointing the gun at me? It's unnerving. <laughs> sure, you can go and step up the vehicle for me again. Why this time? You step out the vehicle so you can stay out the vehicle. This is stupid. Go and fetch the vehicle for me, sir. Why? Because right now I'm placing you um, in cuffs and detaining you. For what purpose? What? Go and fetch the vehicle, sir. I'll explain everything to you once I have you detained. I would rather you explain it to me now. Nuh uh. Hey, no, go ahead and get out. Sir, get out. step out the vehicle. Get out. What did I just hit? What step out the fucking vehicle right now. What am I stuck get on? Get out of the van. Get out of the van. Get out the vehicle right now. This is fucking hands bullshit. Up. Nope. Put your hands up. Get your fucking hands up. Stop walk. Gone. <laughs> gone, 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 gone. Nah. -uh. What the fuck? I stuck on a rock. <laughs> nice try. I heard a taser then. Please don't. Yes. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, god damn it, come on. I don't even know where I'm going. I got a long ass run ahead of me. <laughs> I'm going up the tower.
<laughs> Piss off. <laughs> I don't have any other guns on me. Uh, I got a flashlight. That's not really productive. Gonna, I'm just going to stay up here until they figure out a way to get me down. <laughs> just pointing at them. <laughs> uh, let me wave to them. <laughs> um, fuck it, I might as well have some fun. Oh, what was it? Uh, what's the moat? I think it's sexy dance. Yep, that's what you want to do. <laughs> There's no shits given. Buddy, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I'm gonna need you to step down from that, okay? Why, though? Because you're gonna be placed under arrest. For what? You can just tell him. Well, sir. Uh, well, right now, fleeing and eluding from an LEO. Possession of a weapon with a history of a felony, sir. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. I was told explicitly by 520 I suck legal suck. I took legal advice from him and he told me that I can have a musket. Alright, sir. Then you can step down the tower and we can figure out what's going on. Instead you decide to run from us. Well yeah, because I've been arrested on bullshit charges so many times. I'll think about coming down once I've had my spliff. Do you have any weapons on you right now, sir? No. As I said, I'm only allowed a musket. That is considered a weapon, though. So do you have a musket on you? No, it's in the van. Okay. What were you doing when you stepped out the van? Uh, put my musket in the back. Okay. So I'm gonna need you to climb down from there, sir. Yeah, I'm just enjoying my spliff. One minute. Not much left now. <laughs> sir, if you're not gonna come down, I'm gonna get you down, okay? And how exactly would you plan on doing that? Keep climbing. Sir, you can go and stop walking now. No, I'm going to the car. Make it easier. Sir, do you want to get tased again? <laughs> what do you mean again? You didn't hit me the first two times. <laughs> or Face away from us. That's not away, sir. That's at the car. Thank you. You I guys mean, cover? Surely it'd be better to point me at the car. Hey, Tom's here as well in the Discord. It's a nice little party we got going on. Alright, sir. Why don't you go ahead and get in the back of this charger? God damn it. Did, did you search him? No, I didn't. Hang on, sir. I mean, I'm sat down in the nice, warm, out. heated seat now, so... I promise you it's not heated. It's a plastic shell. 
Well, it's more comfy than standing. You should have stepped back out of the vehicle, please. You can go ahead and step out or I can pull God, you out. You guys are so fucking awkward. Go ahead and face the car. Empty weed baggy and hoodie pocket. Weed is legal in Florida, as far as I know. I'm just standing here making sure you ain't trying to get out or anything, you know. That's kind of what I'm tied up doing, I guess. No, I'm not gonna try. I just got fed up of being put in cuffs for bullshit reasons. I didn't break the law, simple as that. Well, I mean, if you got put in cuffs, there's a reason behind it, man. I thought that guy was going to park on the train tracks then. In fact, I was kind of hoping for it because I would have been funny as hell. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Park your car. Yeah. <laughs> uh, why don't you go ahead and take him since you were um, initiating? Um, I can meet with you though if you um, need help with the charges. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll probably figure it out. Thank you. The only charge yeah, they should get me on is fleeing and eluding. The only one I'll actually admit to doing. Alright, Mr. Bastard, you can go and step out for me, okay, sir? Do the hokey pokey turn around, is it? Yes, sir, we're gonna move you into this uh, Sheriff Explorer here, okay? So, what am I gonna be charged with then? Since you only actually have one thing on uh, me. Well, sir, I will figure it out at the station with you, alright? If that's okay with you? Not really, but it doesn't appear like I have much of a choice. Okay. I mean... Yeah, thank you, Trooper. Is it alright if we take you to the station? It's no, right, actually, it's not. Anything else okay, we'll take you anyway. I think you should be good, thanks. Alright, if you guys need anything else, just uh, give me a yellow bird. Alright, yeah, will do, thank you. It's unlawful for any person to own or have his or her care, custody, possession, or control of any firearm, ammunition, or electric weapon or device, or a carried concealed weapon, including tear gas, gun, or chemical weapon device, if that person has been a convicted felon in the court state system. Um, I looked all through it. There are no exceptions besides a convicted, convicted felon heaven whose civil rights and firearm authority have been restored or criminal expungement has been authorized by the court system. So, musket to me, the musket is a firearm because it classifies as a firearm. They're both convicted felons. Um, the, gentleman that's being transported down to PD has a little bit more because he took off on us. Uh, the other gentleman worked with me, he talked with me, and once I explained to him that it's still classified as a firearm, but this is the big book. It doesn't have anything in there about a exception to antique weapons. Um, he took off on foot. Yeah, possession of a firearm by a convicted felon, so penal 7... 90.23 would be that classification. Uh, fleeting, eluding. Uh, There's no accident or injury, so it's just a minor version of the fleeing. No, and I'm going to dispute this because I find the up. actual, um, the actual. Yeah, the Scooby Doo van can't run anyways. Motherfucker. Yeah, I'm gonna dispute this. All right. Well, that there that clears it up because I know me and the other trooper here were kind of. It might have fallen under an exception, but I'm not finding any exceptions besides expungement and restor restoration of civil rights. Right. So that's their version with the big book, as they call it, with the law. 
I now have my quote, which I checked before going shooting, from the, what was it called, the Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission, which is a US government run thing, I believe. I shall quote that to them and see what they think. Alright, sir, are you ready to hear your charges today? You mean charge, there's no S, it's singular. Charges, alright, listen closely. Oh, I'm listening. Charge number one is fleeing, eluding an LEO, which is a felony three or $50,000 fine. I admit to that one. Charge number two is resisting arrest without contention, which is a misdemeanor. A $20,000 fine. And charge oh, number that. three is possession of a firearm with a history of felonies, which is a felony one or a $150,000 fine, sir. I object to that and I have proof. Uh, okay, sir, what's your proof? I would like to um, consult section 790.001 slash 1 of the Florida statute system. I checked this before I went shooting. It states that antique firearms, mine was built in 1796, means any firearm manufactured in or before 1918, including match locks, flint locks, percussion cap, or similar early types of ignition system. Mine is a um, percussion cap, built in 1796. Okay, sir, so go and repeat that statute for me. It's 790.001 slash 1. Section 1, sorry. 790 on that? Uh, point zero zero one, section 1. 790.001, section 1. I'll read it to my viewers while I'm waiting. Antique firearm means any firearm manufactured in or before 1918, including any matchlock, flintlock, percussion cap, or similar early type of ignition system, or replica thereof. Whether actually manufactured before or after the year 1918, and also any firearm using fixed ammunition manufactured in or before 1918, for which ammunition is no longer manufactured in the United States, and is not readily, be readily available in the ordinary channels of commercial trade. Alright, sir. <laughs> you found it? Found it, and I'll take care of it. That um, this could have gotten a whole lot easier if you would not have taken taken off from us, sir. I know, but I'm fed up of being put in cuffs for bullshit reasons. It happens a lot more okay. than I like to well, admit. Well, then next time, because I'm sure there's going to be a next time with uh, someone with your record, um, I I would advise you if an officer stops you and he he is in he believes that he is going to be arresting you for uh, that charge right here. Um, <laughs> you mentioned this, uh, this statute to him and politely ask him to uh, research it for you. Okay? You see, a, a similar thing happened before and a buddy of mine did this and they was just like, nope. And they sent him straight to jail of, um, nonetheless, so... It's kind of why I wasn't too anxious to stick around. That's actually true as well. I got What's your place of birth? Uh, San Andreas. Does that matter? Uh, do you have a city for me? Yeah, I was born up in uh, Grapeseed. I just made that up. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm going to end it here because I got out of that one charge. It's just the fleeing and looting and... We know how that goes, it's the same every time. So I'm going to end it here. Thank you guys so much for watching, and uh, make sure you guys come back for the next episode, and I will see you then. Peace out, guys.